Hi, my name's Summer Finlay. I'm a Yorta Yorta woman and a PhD candidate with the University of South Australia. I want to talk to you about Aboriginal medical services and indicators. I know it's not a very sexy topic, but it's something that is actually really important to me and the Aboriginal community controlled health sector. I'm currently standing on a Wobbicool country, Westlake Macquarie. A Wobbicool has one of the 150 Aboriginal community controlled health services from around the country. Now these health services are set up by Aboriginal people for Aboriginal people, and they're also known as ATCHOs. The ATCHOs have to report against a set of national key performance indicators, and it's the impact of these national key performance indicators on the Aboriginal community controlled health services, which is the focus of my PhD. Since the indicators were introduced in 2012, there's been no evaluation. There has been a data quality review, however, the recommendations in that data quality review have not been undertaken. There are three phases to this project. The first phase is a document audit of the NKPI reports. So what's happening at a service delivery level with these NKPIs? That's what I'm hoping to understand through the five case studies. I'm also trying to understand what's happening at the policy level around the NKPIs and their perceptions about what's happening on the ground. And I'm doing that through stakeholder interviews. And there's a final component which brings all of the elements together in a survey which will go out to the 150 ATCHOs to test whether or not the findings from the other components are generalisable. This piece of work is really important to the ATCHOs. Aboriginal Community Controlled Health Services are there to see clients. Their primary focus is improving health outcomes for Aboriginal and Torres Strait Islander people. Any new framework or policy which is introduced needs to be efficient and effective and not take them away from their core business too much. Are the NKPIs introduced efficiently and effectively? That's what I want to find out.